Masked figures slipped down twisty paths as a neon orange Cheshire cat peered down from its perch, high atop a crumbling stone wall. The Red Queen cackled as she held court on a candlelit patio, overflowing with guests dressed in tuxedos and cocktail dresses. Over on a patch of manicured lawn, excited shrieks rose up as bets were placed on a do-or-die croquet match. It was the Mad Hatter Masquerade, an autumn fundraiser for the Charleston Opera Society, and what Theodosia Browning decided was a voyage into crazy town. As the owner of the Indigo Tea Shop on Charleston's famed Church Street, Theodosia was used to staging exciting events. A firefly tea at an old plantation, a murder mystery tea in a haunted house, even a honeybee tea in Pettigrew Park. But the Opera Society's masquerade party at the old Pendleton Grist Mill near the city marina was the most unconventional venue she'd ever seen. The Grist Mill's twisty walkways, jagged walls, and flaming torches brought to mind the ancient battlements of a ruined Scottish castle. Sprinkle in strolling musicians, fire eaters, dancing fairies, a dozen or so Alice in Wonderland characters, two bars, and three hors d'oeuvre stations, and you had yourself a first-class high society soiree. Gathering up her ankle-skimming black silk skirt, Theodosia turned to Drayton Connolly, her tea sommelier, peered through the eye slits of her peacock-feathered mask and said, can you believe this party? She was practically agog at the revelers and entertainers streaming past them. Drayton, who was decked out in a tuxedo and white half-mask, reminiscent of the Phantom of the Opera, said, it's really quite magnificent. The friends of the opera have truly outdone themselves this time. He took a sip of his peach tea smash and nodded to himself as if to punctuate his words. Aren't you glad we helped with the appetizers? I'm just tickled we got invited. Theodosia laughed a rich, tinkling laugh that crinkled her startlingly blue eyes and caused her mass of auburn hair to shimmer in the candlelight.